My name is Ghazala Mahmood and I'm a software support engineer for IBM. After watching this video, you will be able to create a results set query in work order tracking application. Step one, login as max admin user. Click go to work order module, work order tracking application. In this example, I will be creating a query against status equals approve. Click on approve. Click enter. Here you can see there are 241 work order records with the status approve. You save the query that you have created. Name the query, for example, IBM test. In this example, I'll be using the default query. Click OK. The query has been saved. Click on Save Query, View Manage Queries. Find the query which you have just saved, IBM test. Here you can see the query that I've created against status approve. Click OK. Step two, click on Start Center. Change content layout. Here you have the left column and the right column. I will be using the left column to display my result set query. Select content. Select the portlet you wish to use in this instance. It will be the result set. Result set portlet. Click on the result set. Click OK. Click finished. As you can see on the left hand side, you can see the result set portlet has been created. Step three, you will now need to click on edit portlet icon. Filter for the query you have just created. IBM test. On the column display, you can choose the query column you would like to display, for example, filter for work order. Click Save. Status. Click Save. And work location. Click Save. Click Finished. If I just scroll down. Step 4. Now you can see the Start Center, the result set portlet has been created against work order tracking application. You can see that it has 241 records display against approved.